This is Shannon O'Connell um, talking about discussion five and my response to the three different perspectives based on a controversial topic. And I chose to do abortion. I thought um, it's, you know, I've done that a couple of times for this course and I see a trend, you know, in people's opinions and what they believe and how strongly they, be they feel about their beliefs. So I thought this would be really interesting to look at three different perspectives from the pro-life individual, the mother who is the individual who actually has to decide whether to have the abortion, and then from the perspective of the unborn child. And I started with the pro-life individual because that I pictured it was me and my thoughts and how I felt. And um, it gave me an opportunity to put those thoughts on paper and then I had the opportunity to sit back and be the individual that is actually in the situation that needed to have the abortion. And wow, what an eye opener um, to sit back and think about what that mother may be going through or what they may be thinking. Um, and finally, the last response or perspective that I looked at was that of the unborn child. And, you know, at what point is that baby's heart beating? And at what point, um, when do they have rights? And how to make it that decision for that unborn child. You know, there's many people in the world, there's even more perspectives I could have gone from. It could have been the perspective of the mother who's trying to adopt and would so desperately do anything to have that child. But all in all, I thought this exercise was really interesting to have the opportunity to sit back and, and uh, put yourself in someone else's shoes. And I think that's where many of us go wrong in our opinions and whatnot on social media. And it gave me an opportunity to sit back and think about how I would change some of the responses or things that I say and do um, based on other people's opinions. And it's important to always think of what other people might think and feel based on the things that you say. Because we are all individuals and we have the opportunity to think and feel for ourselves. So I thought it was a really interesting exercise. Thank you.